Hey guys, it's Bricky here today with a with a Baby Legend Hyperblade BB105 Cosmic Magazine FD Unboxing and Review. So I got this at Target. Um, my mom got it at Target yesterday on August 7th. And after she called two uh, nearby Target and Toys R they said they did not have it. So a, a 30 minute away um, Target away from my house. They actually had wave one completely, so she's holding them, so she can buy the, them uh, today. So, guys, this is the unboxing review of Cosmic Pegasus and has to basically copy the Kratomi. And guys, I'm recording this with a Sony camera, my old Sony camera, because I left my Nikon J1 at my mom's school. So I have to wait until Monday to get it, because it's close for the weekend. So, um, I'll probably be, be using my Sony camera for now, just for a couple of days, just for like one day. Or even just this video. So I just on Monday to tune in for more awesome videos on my Nikon J1. So here are the cards. I love how Hasbro assembled the base put inside the box. That is so unique. So um that targeted and now we're gonna reveal the parts. So right now we're gonna review the face bolt. The face bolt is just the same as the color told me, the same design, there's nothing really special to say about it. But, um, did you say that the Hasbro version of Cosmic Pegasus looks a bit lighter? Like, the, the blue color looks a bit lighter, more sparkle than the Takatomi. And the Takatomi, of course, must be more heavier than the Hasbro version. So, um, right now we just reviewed that space bolt thing. Oh, and I also have to tell you something about the energy ring. This is Pegasus third. Or should I say Pegasus the third? <laughs> So basically, um, this Pegasus version, well, Hasbro's version of Cosmic Pegasus, it looks much lighter than the, the Takeda told me, and I might do a, a comparison video between those bays. So I'm just saying that it's different, like, completely not, so, well, they're, they're, they're just a little different between those, those bays. So here's the PT frame. The PT frame allows you to chain mode to Pegasus, also including Pegasus, um, other metal wheel, the core so you can change mode with that and that's sh that just changes his um Pegasus performance during battle. So right now you're gonna take a look at um cosmic which is Big Bang and Takeratomi or in Japanese. So this is cosmic and it has three wings on the side which give which, which gives um enormous attack power to its opponent to knock it out. So this is cosmic, it's just beautiful, look at it and those points are sticking out from the wheel that's where the PC goes, you can just switch it to a different mode and the core goes in the bottom of the metal wheel. So right now we're just gonna go check the core. Yep. So right now um the core is quite amazing. It also changes modes with the PC frame. So the PC frame you can just mess it around to see the modes. Um there are four modes. I forgot one some of them but um it, um one of them is attack mode, um omnidirectional mode, um upper attack I think but I'm not really sure um, I'll show you in the in the in the later on in the video. So this is the core you just chain mode with it. So basically uh yep core 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 this is taking forever <laughs> so um right now we're gonna look at final drive one of the best parts in cosmic packages slash big band packages so final drive FD actually gives it a good advantage in battle because once you launch it, it will be stamina in quotations. It will act like one, but later on battle, once you get like some couple of hits, it will swish. The, that blue tip is actually going to go inside and the rubber tip, which is rubber flat quotations, it, uh, Pegasus is going to spin wild, wildly around the, the battle, causing the opponent to have a stadium out at some point of the battle. So basically this is why Cotton Pegasus is pretty good uh, bay. Um, FD, I don't think a lot of people might use it for co competition. I don't really prefer to use that FD because it loses stamina quickly. So, um, well actually, um, it, it said on the, on the world Beyblade.com uh, or Beyblade Wikia, I read about Cosmic packages and um, they said that it's not really good, especially the metal wheel because it's too, it's actually the widest 4D uh, metal wheel and out of all 4D bait. So basically, I don't think it's a really good, you know, part to use in competitions and competitive tournaments. 
so um here the the other part inside the box that is the record uh launcher and it's red so um it has bill um i don't really prefer to use record it but just one tip if you are using record and you don't have a thing launcher just keep that record straight do not keep it bended it because it'll be a lot harder to launch with so just put it on water heat it up and then bend it up and then right now we just uh, the the record and this is the assembly tool which you use to assemble cosmic packages or the bait no matter what so uh, just for the unboxing of cosmic packages <laughs> and i'm really tired of talking <laughs> So right now we're gonna be looking at the instruction sheet after I tell you um the assembly tool. Wait for it. There you go. Okay, so this uh instruction sheet is A is A to up. No, that's for the token. <laughs> anyway. So this is the instruction sheet of Cosmic Packages. Hasbro didn't really change the design. I'm kind of disappointed that they didn't because it would be awesome if they did. And they took out the you know, they took out the part where you launch the bay. So it just um, told you uh, how to put the bay inside the launcher, um, cosmic packages, the parts. Um, it also tells you the four modes, but sometimes uh, Hasbro kind of um, messes up the modes, and sometimes they're in the wrong order. You know what I mean? Like for example, Phantom Orion for attack and stamina, they put it on the wrong way in, in the certain sheet. So basically, it's kind of Hasbro's fault, no offense. But I think they did a great job in Big League Legends and I love that a lot of people are looking at it and I love that a lot of people are getting it nowadays and I think it's gonna be quite popular. So um guys thanks for watching. What do you think of this unboxing? Please like, comment and subscribe for more videos starting Monday. Thanks for watching guys.